Welcome to my COVID CO2 tracking app. The central feature of this app is the ability to view measurements other people have taken of CO2 by location. To view a location, simply click on the place marker and it will bring up the measurements for that location. They are sorted by sublocation, that is where inside the location that they were taken. If you wish to upload your own measurements, of course, first you need a device. And then click sign in with Google. It will sign in. If this is your first time, then it will likely ask for your permission. Then it loads. Then add your device. Go to devices, pick the manufacturer of your device, or if it's not there, add it yourself with create new manufacturer. I'm going to assume we're adding an Aeronet because that's a very popular device and so it meant such as an Aeronet 4. So click pick and add. Enter your serial number. I, not all devices have serial numbers, but if you do, it's very useful to keep track of this information. We're going to put some sort of nonsense in here because it doesn't matter. It's not a real device. Then it will show up in your profile where your list of devices and your measurements are. We're going to go back home. The location we selected earlier is still selected. And we're going to click Upload. The device is still selected. Enter this CO2 level. We're going to pick some nonsense. If you're entering the measurement as you take it, it'll, you can leave it as now. If you're enter uploading a measurement that you've taken in the past, click Custom, and it will give you the ability to put a different date in at a different time. Say how crowded it is. I'm going to imagine it's almost empty. We're also going to imagine it's in the milk aisle. Click Submit New Measurement, and it will show up right there. You can also click see detailed information and it will give you, there will be charts here too, but it will give you a shareable link here and you can paste that in a tweet or an email to share it. And if you navigate to it, the browser will open up this page. Now, if you wish to change a measurement, there currently is no way to do that, sadly. I'll update the app in the future, but currently just delete it and re-enter it. So click delete and it will be removed in the database. And if you wish to delete your device, you first must make sure all that all the measurements you've made that are from that or by that device or, or deleted, and then you can delete the device. Alrighty. Now that measurement that we just created should be gone now. Good. And you can also view measurements that other devices and devices that belong to other people have, have uh, recorded. So Aeronet 4 is a pretty popular device, so we're going to click on it. And it's going to bring up the four known uh, measurements in that database, or in, in <laughs> of that device in the database. It looks, I think many of these belong to the one, um, some of these were taken in Spain, I think. I have not built the feature for going to show exactly where the measurement was and give detailed information yet that will come soon. Alrighty, you can add measurements to your heart's content now. If you have questions or issues, you can go to the GitHub page where you can file an issue and there will be information on a wiki as documentation eventually. You can also sponsor here or down here. Thank you very much. Stay safe. Bye-bye.